What if I can show you guys these here? They are the black diamond carbon cork trekking poles. Sorry about the no frills video, but here it is anyway. <clears throat> so, company Black Diamond. And the Alpine Carbon Cork. Well, it says Alpine Carbon there, but of course, indeed, they are cork handles. And as you can see, I've had these for quite a while. So they've, they've seen, I'd say probably a good nine years of use. Uh, Kilometre wise, yeah. I can't even begin to uh, get my head around that, to be, to be honest. Definitely five or six thousand, seven thousand, yeah. They've, they've, they've had love, let's just say that. When you first get them, uh, they're not brown. I've tried to clean them off, but that's just how they are. Anyway, without further ado, let's crack on with, with it rather than giving me a lot of the shit like. Um, are they good? Well, in my, in, my, in my opinion, yes, they are. They are like the best that you can get. Because, well, why? One is, they are solid as. I've even drove over one of these, accidentally, of course, with a Jeep. And nothing, yeah. Uh, I have had to replace the ends. Um, after walking several thousand at the end of their life. and um, But yeah, I've just replaced them and... They're ready to go again, so they've had some new tips on and new ends. Apparently, I thought they were glued on, but I don't believe they are. I just cut them and just put the other ones on. Anyway, good little tip. When you're putting those on, don't bang them in too hard. Just throwing it out there. Otherwise, you'll have one banged in more than the other by a couple of mil, which is annoying. If you're a calculated person like me on those kind of things. Anyway, right, so these are obviously sp specific to my, or to my size. And, of course, the great thing about these is they fall down. Yeah. There and there. So, the great thing about the fact they fall down is that there will fit inside your day bag on your well if you're going abroad if you're going overseas or traveling depends on wherever you live in the world that will fit in and if it doesn't then simply take that off like that pull that out because you've got ends on and then then it'll go in. You know what I mean? So like that. And if you want, if even if you want to, you can take that piece off as well. You've probably watched many videos and seen lots of people using trekking poles. So I'm not going to go into that. I'm just going to tell you that if you want a pair of trekking poles, don't buy anything else except for those. That's all I'm saying. Like because they're absolutely and utterly fucking phenomenal. Like, I kid you not. Like, when you... When you've got them like that, you, you can hold them in a few different positions. So, obviously you can hold them like that. Let me just... Sort of get this around here. So it's tricky trying to do it with one hand. Oop. So yeah, so you can hold them obviously like that. When you're going downhill, you can hold them like that. And of course, when you're going uphill and you don't want to adjust them, you've got a beautiful little knuckle there. 
So I got my dirty hands. I've been working today, so um, yeah. So you've got this beautiful knuckle there, where you can you can really sort of grab hold of them, and then go uphill like that. They're beautifully ergonomically designed. And they have got a left and right. Well, you can see it on mine anymore. But let's just flip that around. It's about the, the, the faff here, guys. No, it's gone, I think. it's she, she has disappeared. I know one of them does. Yeah, winner. There you go. It's just... Can just make it out it's right so there you go so you do have a left and a right and of course you can adjust them according to what what your size is so they are the very well loved black diamond carbon cork alpine trekking poles from obviously black diamond could not rate them high enough. Magnifique.